All right. That's what life. Are we? Yes. All right, now this works. Everybody? Yes. To those who are loyal and still here, I love you guys. This is a great. All right, let's, uh, let's go and do this. We are now here at 10,000 feet. That's not how it's supposed to start the whole thing. Everybody, welcome to an airport that has a grass runway, suggested by someone. So, guys, are we ready to land at a grass runway? I mean, that's a very local airport. Like, it probably couldn't get more local than this. Oh, God, it's gone. Uh, I think it's EDVM. Yes. Let's try it. Hildesheim. Oh, was that the one? Ah, that's 4,000 foot of asphalt. That'll be plenty. All right, let's try that one. Uh, maybe, uh... I think the 737-600 served us pretty well last time. We're going to do straight an approach into this airport. Air Corio, of course. Guys, welcome back. And yes, it works. And I'm going to try LOAC Airport next. Let's see. All right. So... Let's take a look. Electronic gameplay has donated, and, and let's see. I, I think the donation should show. <laughs> if I'm not a stupid idiot. All right, guys. Let's take a look at a landing done at an interesting airport with an interesting airplane. Let's go in. Oh no! Why are we at 38,000 feet? What's that kind of approach, Microsoft Flight Simulator? Oh, I set this up the wrong way, and this is very annoying. I'm, 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 I'm really sorry. We should, we should be more relaxed, and maybe the good thing is now we have a little bit less viewers, and so I think the chances of your airport being picked for an approach and arrival is quite high. You know, not bad at all. Let's maybe try this again. Hill Design Airport, arrival, arrival, arrival. Good. All right, buckling up. As always. Now, it's been a while since since Electronic has donated, as well as Arthur. Um, why isn't it showing up? Why doesn't why isn't it showing up? Ah! Holy moly! All right. Now, dear passengers, we will now be approaching a runway. It might be short, but life is short. So maybe it's not a coincidence at all. So let's take a look. Let's keep the airplane nice and <laughs> steady. Take a look. Where's their stupid runway? Honestly, I cannot see it yet. I I, I can't see it. It's right there. It's gonna take a while until we get there. Four thousand foot though. It should be plenty for this uh, seven three seven. We have this fast mode, which lets us go. Uh, like do a time lapse of flying. Let's not stall this. Holy moly! Let's not crash this either. Jesus Christ! All right, so it's all fine. We need to find the runway, which sometimes on lower graphics can be quite a challenge. All right, it's down there. How are we supposed to be able to do that? All right, let's do it. I think it's still in like some sort of a fast mode. All right, dear passengers, welcome once again here. This is a beautiful 737. We're on a beautiful flight. And welcome to the major show. I'm annoyed. Is my YouTube broken? Please. Oh, uh, Henry. We tried Newcastle on on Sunday, didn't we? Did we not? I think we did. All right. So. It's time to land. Um, we're on a very stabilized approach at 1,700 feet per minute. Oh, player president! How you doing, man? Player president donated two dollars and eighteen cents. Happy birthday! Thank you. When you land at the airport EDMF. It's a short runway and is 410 meter long. When you fly over the waypoint ranker, you can see a town with three river. That's, I guess, your town. E V M F. Is it V? All right. I have to change that. EVMF. So, let's take a look now. We will be landing shortly. It's going to be interesting. Tell them to go to LaGuardia. Okay, Deno, I will. Caution, 
Oh, there's the runway. We're very unstable. We've got 2.3 thousand gallons. Which isn't much of fuel. Uh, that's that's not that's not for ah! Oh, the rudder is way too sensitive. I cannot fly airplanes at all with this kind of sensitive rudder. It's kind of a brake test here, which hasn't worked. Let's go ahead and ignore this landing. Everything is fine. This has worked absolutely beautiful. I'm already annoyed that the donations. I mean, you guys are spending actual money. It's not the fucking live stream. What's wrong? Um, all right, next off. I'm, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, this is supposed to work. Let's try EVMF. Doesn't even exist. EWMF. That doesn't exist either as a code. I'm sorry, player president. Let's try uh, Loag. Loaf. Interesting one. Langanuis. Krems. That's somewhere in the beautiful Austria land. And we're going to have to touch down on the threshold. It's it's not a very easy runway. You guys told me to fly to whatever that, why ever you did, why ever the hell you did that. Let's, let's just ignore that. We've got a 737-600. Let's not mess up. I'm so sorry. I don't want to. Why? I'm really, I'm really sorry. I need to fix the donation system. That's uh, obviously not working for some reason. I have no idea. All right, dear passengers, welcome to beautiful Austria land. Come on, that's a little bit closer to North Korea than Hildesheim in Germany land. So this is all fine. Uh, it's just really a matter of figuring out where the runway is. Is that the one right there? I think I see it. It's very small. I have no idea why you guys wanted me to fly there. But it's going to be interesting for sure. Let's maybe keep it a stable approach and not like last time. How do you doing, player president? Player president donated two dollars and eighteen cents. It was EDMF. Echo e Delta Mike Fox Trot. Echo Delta Mike. I understood it as EVMF. Thank you for spelling out the uh, the NATO. So it's also French, uh, a German airport. <laughs> it says French. Yeah, no one from France land watches my video, although, I'm, although I mock them all the time, which is great. Let's take a look. Uh, runway's right there. This is going to be great. This is going to go well. I need to somewhat find a way to adjust the sensitivity on the rudder because it's absolutely crazy. If I move a micro centimeter, which doesn't exist as a link, but take a look. If, if I move a micrometer, right? Like, that just completely rips the tail off. And we're going to end up like the 767 that's crashed. You know? It's interesting. That's a perfect, perfect recipe for disaster. And I'm just always so impressed about how slowly this airplane can fly before stalling out. That's very easy. Take a look at that. Let's not crash, maybe. All right. I think I do see the runway. All is fine. Uh, we do want to lose some altitude. We may just be a little high. It's hard to get the dimensions right. We're a very fast airplane, and this is a very short runway. You need to be super slow. All right. Let's try this. We should be able to handle this. So, yeah, I don't know why, but I don't know. Maybe the YouTube donation system is fried today. Yesterday it all worked. I don't know. I'm really sorry. The only thing that does work is um, is the donations via the, uh, the description, which is better anyway, because you can theoretically, if you want, you can turn the engines off. And please don't do that. Please don't spend money on that, because this is a runway where I actually don't want to have this. Take a look. It's like, what is it? 2,000 foot long asphalt runway. I don't think having a engine out would increase our chances of stopping, you know. So, let's take a look right now. We are, again, on this beautiful 737-600. The baby Boeing. Um, 
Yeah, we, we should be able to do this, you know. Rockcliffe Airport, Ottawa. Okay, Rock... Rockcliffe. Thank you so much, man, for your support. Rockcliffe. Perfect. Thank you. All right, guys. Let's do it. 114 knots. Slow. I like, again, how slowly this airplane can fly. I mean, we're running on 5% of fuel. If you haven't noticed that. Uh, we're very, very uh, uh, slow and very, very light, perhaps, too. Which is going to help our stopping. I just hope that the brakes still work after our chaotic endeavors of trying to stop at these random places. We need to descend quite a bit, so I'm going to put the speed brakes out. Take a look at this. Runway is coming up. All right. Yeah, yeah. I know. Terrain warning. I think it's like kind of like a sloped runway. It almost appears like it's a slight hill that we're now landing up towards. Does that make sense? Not quite sure. All right. There are passengers. We'll go back to, to Air Corio. Um, we're flying to this random 2,000 foot long runway now. Will this work? Hopefully. Oh, Heracleon from Greece. Oh, we tried that yesterday already. Sorry to break the news, but we did. But it worked. It was a beautiful... We, we tried the short runway because Heracleon has a ridiculously short runway for some reason that no one knows. It's great. Try to land. Keep this airplane on the runway. Oh, how you doing, man? Uh, Stavanger. Oh, interesting, too. Sure. Uh. What? I have no idea how that just didn't work. That, uh. What? what how, did you guys just see that? How did that not work? Let's take a look at a beautiful landing. I thought it was great. We were at 100, and, 100 knots touching down, which should have worked perfectly for our needs of stopping quickly on this tiny runway. Take a look at this. So now here we are, touching down very quickly as soon as the threshold begins. Take a look. I think this was handled quite well. Keeping the elevator up, keeping everything up. This one should have worked, you idiot. All right, sad, very sad. We should try another airport then. Um, skill issue, yeah, I think the problem is we should try another airplane because the 737's brakes are now fried from our previous landings that we've tried so far. So we're, we're gonna try to use other, other methods. It's just a shame that, man, I'm so, so sorry for these people that that donate and it doesn't show up. This kind of stuff that actually <laughs> it annoys me. So let's try the Boeing A380. A plane that I've been very much struggling with. It's from Bredog. I hate it. Everyone hates it, but they still fly because well, it's the only A380 that we have. All right, Rock Cliff. Please don't be. A short runway. I cannot spell. Rock Cliff, Ottawa. Is it small? 3,300 feet. Maybe. Maybe it's going to work. You know. Dublin Airport. Yeah. Been there. Done that. Lots of Ryanair. Pleasant experience. Very good. All right, so the Boeing A380 is loading up. The common Boeing A380 takeoff speed is 150 knots, 280 kilometers per hour. Great, let's get uh, ready to fly. All right, fried. All right, guys. Let's try to land here at this Ottawa airport. All right, that's interesting. It's kind of, is that the city of Ottawa of Canada? 
I believe it would be. Um, all right, interesting. We are a little... Well, actually, we're flying quite all right. I want to do a little faster approach, so let's do 160 knots while we come in for this beautiful Ottawa runway. It's kind of in the middle of the city. That's interesting. Now, what I kind of hate about this is kind of... I mean, we're flying an A380 um, with a yoke. I mean, it is a Boeing plane. What am I saying? But no, we're flying this Airbus A380 with a yoke, which makes no sense. And also the trim, you can see it down there, is affected by my trim inputs. Guess what? The Airbus is a British Airbus Just want to make that point about the Braddock A380. Like, I mean, there is an Airbus that has a lot of trim in the Microsoft Flight Simulator. It's called the Airbus A320. How, how can you mess that up? You know, it's not hard. Swiss, look at my donation. A real whale. Sorry, man. It's just, it's just show up and hate it. Lufthansa Aviation, one, uh, uh, 99 cents. Thank you so, so much. That's really kind. It's just a shame that I can't get it to work. Well, why? How did it break overnight? Did they, like, drop support or something? Like, the YouTube thing? I'm really sorry. Big and Hill. All right, good. Big and Hill, we shall try that again. Thank you so, so much for the five pound, mate. Uh, I'm, I'm so, so sorry. This is supposed to work, you know. Big inhale. Perfect. Maybe someone there lives nearby. Welcome to the beautiful Ottawa city of Canada land. And once again, A380 from Boeing landing on this relatively tiny, what was that? 3,000 foot long runway. This seems like a GA airport that the Green Party would want to shut down. depending on if no you don't have a pluralism party system in Canada do you is it, is it a welcome to education 001 oh San Diego beautiful idea man thank you so so much perfect San Diego land that's a perfect idea man Mikhail's the elixir do that will be perfect that'll that'll do well all right, guys, so we're now landing. Let's just make sure, yes, all the engines are affected by our throttle inputs. We're very high, uh, I reckon. I'm not quite sure about the dimensions of the runway, and it doesn't have poppy poppy lights. Lehigh Valley. Lehigh Valley. Where's that? Is that in... Is that in North Carolina? I forgot. I should, I should stop literally texting and driving. It's flying. I'm literally texting and flying. Fly an Aeroflot A352, Sir Chairman Tievo. Uh, we don't even have an A350 for the flight simulator, man. D Labs, thank you so, so much. I, I have to read them out manually, acoustically, because my stupid software doesn't work anymore. Or maybe it's the stupid YouTube, I don't know. So. Let's go ahead now and try to land on our 3,000 foot long runway in an Airbus A380. Is this going to work? Maybe, I'm not quite sure. We're actually flying relatively stably. I'm trying not to over oscillate the rudder through our sensitive rudder uh, pedals. And dude, Aud Ottawa, you have to kinda, you have to, you have to, you know, game up a little bit. You don't have pompy lights, although they would be slightly useless in our A380 anyway. It's a very wide runway, but it's kind of short, which is interesting. All right, we can see some some interesting artifacts down there on the ground sometimes. Are we high? Are we low? It's a confusing A380, let me just be honest. But we stopped on a 3,000 foot long runway. Hey! Sorry, Oreo. Well, yeah, 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 yeah. I wanted to stop quickly. I don't know how this, like, just physically was possible to do. I'm, I'm a little confused. It's, no! Oh, I messed up the recording. It's gone. We can't. Oh, no. Oh, no. We don't have a replay. Well, good thing is that it kind of sucked anyway. We have actually information about this landing right here. Take a look. Hard landing, 12 
hundred feet to G. To G. And you can see a little side slip right there. Not good at all. Not a good landing. That was definitely induced by my stupid rudder pedals. That's a shame. I'm sorry, but we kind of died anyway. Who gives a damn? Let's let me try. The next airport should be Stavanger. Stavanger. Stavanger airport um is that a long runway so the thing is we should choose a plane before we see the runway so let's maybe see i would like to fly a boeing let's maybe see if we can fly the triple seven okay the kc is triple seven tanker hey that wouldn't be bad by captain simulator oh nuremberg okay nuremberg 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 that's a good idea all right let's do stavanger which I, I know the airport, but I don't know where it is. Is it in Norway? Uh, doesn't show up. What? Let's try Biggin Hill. Oh, Biggin Hill isn't big, right? Biggin Hill is a relatively short runway near London. All right, fifty. Ah, fifty. Ah, okay. Come on, that's five thousand feet. That's more than plenty enough. I did big. I'm going big in here. Crooks, yo. <laughs> yeah, I listened to it. So here I have. I'm writing everything here in in the chat for me to see. Uh, right. So let's take a look. You can try to land at Nice Airport, Cote d'Azur. I mean, come on, that's not a new airport, though. We tried in every single video, or or every second video. Maybe. Tampa North. Oh, how you doing, Az uh, Azizio? You're the yeah, only I one that. Two dollars. Everyone, worry about my please. Uh. Uh. Stroke. I'm not quite sure what that was. Uh. Evra, Evra. Okay, Evra. Thank you. Yes, the donations only actually are visible on the screen if you donate it through the description. Which for me makes no sense. I mean, I don't know why it isn't working anymore. I really apologize. So everybody, welcome aboard 747. I mean, 777. We are just uh, uh, right to London City's airport because we are now landing at a Biggin Hill, which I guess is another place for uh, uh, PJs to land at, you know? So, what we're doing here now is kind of expediting our approach. <laughs> it's interesting how fast this airplane can fly. It's absolutely incredible. So, there we go. Landing gear is already down. Um, let's go ahead and break now. Please stop. And we have some bad lagging. I really don't know why that is. Why is my computer performing as poor as it, it does? Maybe I need a new GPU. Uh, that nigger isn't coming down. Maybe we're too fast. How are we going to play your president? Player president donated two dollars and eighteen cents. When will you land at EDMF? Echo Delta Mike Foxtrot. Ah. I for some reason forgot. I have it right written down. I'm sorry. You're right. Ah, uh, last. That's actually the the hardest way to land planes if it, if your computer sucks. I don't know why but we aren't even running at like very high graphics at all. I feel like. Jesus, it's especially painful because with every lag, ah, that it's like a jump in my motion seat. Verzum, that's an interesting one as well, near Amsterdam land. Uh, oh my god, the lag is impeccable. Please don't ever uh, send me to London. And How high are we? 200 feet? Uh, 
stop now, please. Everything we need to stop. Put all the brakes together. Ah! Oh, no, I didn't mean. I didn't mean to pull up. Please brake now. You are triple seven. Why in the reverse thrust coming out? Oh, the reverse thrust isn't working, and I'm. It's a pain. It's a big pain. We're not gonna be able to stop. God damn it! Why is my leg so hot, laggy? It's it's uh, it's it's a shame. It, it just doesn't work. <sighs> I need a new computer. Take a look at this poor landing done. Firm landing. That's not good. Let's take a look right here. Timeline controls. So we can see this absolute shame of a landing. How do an Abi Zabi? What a nice name. Of this Abi donated two dollars. I dare you to land at Krishan's Tar Ostalum. What is that? What was that? I didn't quite get that because I would I was looking at the laggy landing. What the hell is that? I need I need to get out of Big and Hill, but I guess the triple seven does actually fly relatively well. It's actually not bad at all. Let's go ahead now and take a look and see if we can fly to some other place that doesn't lag as much. Let's maybe try San Diego, where I know it's gonna be worse, right? Um, let's try ADMF. I hope it's not going to be a long runway because obviously we don't have any reverse thrust available and we will overrun in this triple seven because it's a shame, you know. So all is fine. This is absolutely beautiful. Let's go ahead now and see if we can land at EDMF as suggested earlier, you know. EDMF. F first and sell. How many long run? How many runways does it have? How many uh, meters in the runway? Please don't say it has like five feet, and it does have five feet. I'm not gonna be able to. Where is that? Is that like a grass runway that we just saw? How am I supposed to land at that? It's got 1,500 feet of asphalt. I mean, you can't see it right now. Hold on, let me just show you in a second. Uh, uh, we need a, we need a, we need a, we need a very strong airplane. I'm just not quite sure what we're supposed to try. We could maybe try. Uh, oh yeah, maybe let's try it. Let's try an extraordinary one. Let's maybe try the uh, DC six. Right, fifteen hundred feet of asphalt. You can see it down there. It's absolutely not going to work well. Black Hat. Uh, yeah, Lehigh Valley. It's coming in. We're, we're going to do that. Don't worry about it. Uh, Avignon Airport, LFMN, M LFMV. All right, everybody, welcome back to Extra Height Challenge 001. Yes, okay, we're flying in a DC-6. I hope, I hope the loading time isn't going to be very long. Maybe for while we're loading in, we could maybe. Ch oh, never mind. Oh, we have 14,000 feet. Who thought that was a good spawning altitude? Is that the runway down there? Because the problem is it's not going to be. How you doing? Landed Switzerland. Box. So, the Pilatus airfield. We've done that plenty of times. Let's take a look at timeline controls. Landing her down. Oh my god, the lag is actually m worse. It's worse! Can you see that? It's getting worse. Take a look. Oh! No, we need we need we need to somewhat do something about that. I have no idea why the why the lag is this bad. Uh, let's maybe change the global rendering quality to like low, low end. Let's see what that looks like. Probably not too great. Probably look like Xbox. It's still lagging. It hasn't made it a single bit better. It hasn't made it a single bit better. All right. So, um. 
Holy moly, I bet. Why does this stream suck? Look at this. Should we try X-Plane? I think we should. I mean, I will. I should have most airports. They should somewhat work. Let's actually, let's actually do X-Plane now. I want to do X-Plane because this thing just doesn't work. Let me just see right here. I don't wish to be uh, posting my IP4 address. Let's do this. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be back. Let me just start running this. Perfect, perfect, perfect. All right. This should work without any issues. All right. So let's take a look. There we go. Running X-Plane 12. Finally, a real flight simulator that doesn't lag so much. Hopefully, don't please don't lag. All right, so we've got San Diego that's coming up. Uh, I guess we could try that. San Diego, oh, Lehigh Valley. Let's try this. Lehigh. Or maybe, oh, you know what? Actually, we should, we should actually try performing our landing still at the EDMF. Before we move on, we will try this. Uh, not with a 7474. Uh, uh, no, we should be trying this in maybe, maybe the 757. It's a, it's a very sporty airplane. We should try the 757. Let's just see how X-Plane handles it. X-Plane Flight Simulator. I've been wanting to use this in the live stream for a long time, you know. Let's go ahead and change the software from Microsoft here to X-Plane. This should work like an N charm. Let's see also this thing here, motion box, X-Plane, not connected yet. I hope it's going to send out telemetry data. So for the motion seat. So what else do we get? We have Ski Man Ski Lift, Ski Man Ski Lift is back. And he's doing absolute shit box, uh, shit post in the comments. For some reason, the donations don't work. I'm so sorry, Ski Man Ski Lift. Hey Swiss, imagine if a green chicken was an Airbus A380, A380 800 pilot. Well, it's, uh, it's not a very realistic scenario that we're trying to talk about so what we have here is auto ortho the one that i talked about all almost a year ago when it released um you know it's the satellite scenery for x planet we have the whole world installed i just hope that it does work um it might not maybe but i hope it does please please work and don't cause any trouble please It's taking a while to download the scenery. Maybe that's the bad part of this. How to add airport suggestions. I don't know, just scream. Scream it out of your window, maybe I'll hear it. My donation didn't show up. Yeah, I'm sorry, Tanner. I don't know what's wrong with YouTube, but it doesn't, I, I just couldn't get it to work now. For some reason, it doesn't work. The, the only donations that show up are the ones done by the description. Please work now. Please. Why was why is this not working well? Oh, Guernsey Airport. We should try that. Kerry Airport, Kong on us. Lame. I know Tanner is very lame. I really apologize. I should maybe try to takes a really long time please work hi swiss great live stream thank you seb i don't quite believe you 